Hey guys, it's Amanda. So today I'm gonna be doing a favorites video. This is just like current favorites because as I'm filming this on um, February 7th, I'm not, it's, you know, it's a little too late for the last month. So I'm gonna talk about like everything, beauty, fashion, shows, and music. All the things I've been loving right now and I just wanna share them with you. I'm like super excited and let's get started. There's literally a slug on the wall behind me. I'm filming in my garage. There's a slug on the wall behind me, but I'm definitely not touching it and I'm pretty sure it can't hurt me. So I'm just gonna leave it there. So I'm still working on lighting and stuff for this new setup, so bear with me. But yeah, I'm gonna start with clothes because I usually start with makeup and we just are gonna switch it up a bit. So I just rewatched my last favorites video just to make sure I'm not like talking about the same thing. And I realized that I talked about um, RTA shorts and now I'm talking about RTA pants. But the thing is, I'm way, way, way too obsessed with these, and this is like 100% my current favorite right now, so I have to, have to show you. So RTA is one of my favorite brands. They have amazing quality stuff, and I'm just obsessed with it. So basically, these pants are leather, kind of bootcut flare. They're not flare, they're not too crazy wide, but they're just like this. And if you follow me on Instagram, you have seen these like um, every single day. I wear them all the time with everything. Leather pants are already my thing. So like having flared at the bottom, just like, it's like, oh cool. Now a different version of my favorite kind of thing ever. <laughs> so a trend I've been obsessed with lately is track suits. That's just like my go-to look for winter. And also like hoodies, sweatshirts, sweatpants, track suits, that's basically all I've been wearing this like winter time, um, just because I'm lazy and it's also chic because I have like cute ones too. And it's like, everyone's making like really cute track suits. So it's like making it easy to be comfy and warm and cute at the same time. Like girls, if you're like in normal school, of course, like wearing something like this to school is like gonna be your best friend. You're gonna be so comfy and warm and like when you're waking up early for school, you're like not down to get like in jeans or even like lace up your shoes. So this is like the best thing ever. So Daniel Guzio, I just, I just figured out how to pronounce her last name. I was like, I say it so many times and to be pronouncing it wrong like every time, that's like kind of offensive, you know? So I figured out how to say it, Guzio. So she just released these velvet um, track suits. So there's like this cropped velvet hoodie and um, the matching sweatpants. She also sent me the one in blue. So these are, it's just like so chic. I wore this like to a Super Bowl party, literally. So it was a party, but I still wore this sweatpants suit because I made it so chic anyway. And it's so soft and comfy and you look so put together even when you're wearing it. Also mixing and matching these are something, is something that I've been doing. I wore this with like a different pair of sweatpants and like a shirt underneath. You can literally do so much with this. And track suits are just, <laughs> what I've been so obsessed with lately. So basically this is like go-to, you need this in your life. It's also a fun play on like the fact that Juicy Couture track suits are coming back in. Um, I have a black one, which I really love too, but this is like not as like flashy, like juicy. It's just like chill and it gives off the same vibe. So these are shoes I've been obsessed with. This is Robert Clergery, Clergery. I got these from opening ceremony and they're a little bit pricey, but ever since I got my Gucci slides, like, and I wore those completely out, um, I've been obsessed with just like shoes that you can just like slip on and go. So I had to get these ones too because they, um, the Gucci slides have gold on them and like brown on them. So that's like definitely a certain look. These are just all black so I can wear them with anything. And it's perfect like if you're just running out of the house or like you just feel like being lazy like this this also is your go-to school look like put this put come on put this put this tracksuit on put these shoes on like you have to wake up like 10 minutes before you go to school i get a ton of compliments on them from like fashion people but what's like also funny is that like when i post pictures and them like so many girls are like what are those like as if they're like something crazy i didn't know that they were crazy but i guess to like some people they are but Obsessed. For an accessory kind of thing, this is a bag. This is from Pop and Suki. Realize that this is just so good to not ever, ever touch. This, uh, you can like customize it, I think. So mine says steel at the bottom of it. Suki um, sent this to me, so thank you. It's so amazing and it's 
made it in my favorites video because you can wear it a ton of different ways. I haven't tried any other ways. I just carry it like this and it's so easy. I have it on my shoulder and you don't feel it. Like sometimes I'm like, where's my bag? Where's my bag? But then it's like, it's there. I just didn't feel it. So when you don't need to take a bunch of stuff with you and you're tired of carrying a heavy bag, like this is literally the best thing ever. Holds whatever you need and easy to keep on your shoulder. You can do a crossbody. It still looks super cute because it's just like a strap. Like it's not like clunky or big at all. So it's amazing, amazing, amazing. I just like grab it and run out of the house. You guys know I love necklaces and layering necklaces and chokers and stuff. So um, I'll show you which ones I've been loving, like different brands that you can go check out. Um, this one that I'm wearing right now, it says my name on it, it says Amanda. Um, it's from The M Jeweler. So they have like a ton of different um, versions of this necklace and you can obviously custom put your name, your last name, a nickname or something on it. It's super cute. Like it's just so awesome to have like every single day, like just a cute little like necklace choker with your name on it. So yes. Um, and then this one is like the go-to, like just top like two row um, choker. And this one's from Daniel um, Guzio also. So love that girl. Um, but you can, I bet you can find these at like Forever, Forever 21 now, but this is just like what I've been loving. This, um, this necklace is the M Jeweler. I'm pretty sure that's her boyfriend's um, brand. So like this is like a collab between the two of them. So these are both like from her. When I'm wearing gold, I have a bunch of gold chokers too, because it's like, I'll have like a bunch of silver chokers if I'm wearing a silver look. And then I'll like, I'll wear a bunch of gold chokers when I'm having a gold look. So this is like another brand that has amazing, like I think specifically like their gold um, chokers look like just incredible. If, I, if you're looking for something like that, it's like, this is from Fraser Sterling Jewelry. So this is a super, super cute one with like gemstones in it, um, but they have so many different kinds and they're so cute. Like when you're wearing them, you feel like a princess. So obsessed. Also, I've been really into wallet chains. So I've just been like clipping these on my pants and it makes it like edgy and kind of punky. So this is from Room 13 LA. And also like, I love just like, I'll, like wrap it around and like connect it to like different, um, just like do weird stuff with it and like wear it as a necklace or something. It's really cool. And then lastly for jewelry, I have these earrings that I literally wear almost every day like any like look that like dangly earrings go with i'm wearing these and these are from love aj now for makeup um okay this is just life changing so this is the becca multitasking perfecting powder this is in the color fair because i'm <gasps> and i totally knew this was like a thing i'm like acting surprised but i mean i was surprised but I just forgot about it. Basically, it's a pressed powder, normally, not like this. And they have all different shades, which is amazing. Becca is always awesome with color selection. Um, but basically, it's just like a matte powder foundation that has, it comes in this tiny little compact. It's super cute. And I just keep, I just throw that in my purse. That's like basically the only makeup product I need in my purse. I have that and like lip balm. And lipstick so I just use this little brush from here this is this is a Sigma large fluff e50 brush so I love using this with it I'll just like pack it on and like just for touch-ups it's amazing like underneath my eyes if you use a light shade underneath your eyes like just pick it up and like pack on and it gives like such amazing coverage without looking cakey it's literally like I don't know how I live without that product I have another one in a different color I need to re get that color because it's better for underneath my eyes I usually like touch up in places that I need, which are like underneath my eyes and like around my mouth and like on my forehead. Um, but if you feel like throughout the day, like just little spots come off, that is the best go-to touch up powder. Amazing. I also use that like when I'm first doing my makeup, I'll just set underneath my eyes with it. It just like gives like the extra like build and coverage that you need and it doesn't look like powdery at all. So for other skincare products, this is the Tarte Shape tape contour concealer so i've been just using this so much because it's amazing it has like this huge um you know top brush to it it's like it looks like a lip gloss but it's not the perfect angle and amount of product that comes out it's incredible for just like 
going underneath your eyes and like that triangle it really just like lifts your face and they have darker colors too so you can also get like a darker color of this and use it for your contour it's like so so seamless and easy to use and it has amazing coverage too so it's just all around like an amazing product my favorite highlighter at the moment is from this tartist pro glow this is the most insane highlighter i've ever come in contact with so I love this whole palette just because it has everything you need. There's like a cream contour, which the powder like gets in the cream. So I'm not a huge fan of that. And I'm not, I don't really touch that, but maybe I will sometime. The sculpt, this is just a matte bronzer, which is great um, for any kind of contouring. But these are all fun, warm shades. So I guess um, these could be highlighters if you have darker skin tones, but this stunner right here is the one that I really, really love. It's just so opaque. Like it just literally like you shine like crazy. Look at that. Insane. And I love that it's like champagne-y. It's not too gold. It's not too pink. It's like a great mix between it. But what I do really like is after I do like my whole face, I like to take the color of fire, which is like the darkest, um, highlight or shimmery shade and I like to put this um just like dust it over my cheeks like the whole thing like bronze a little bit with some more glowiness and like put it on my cheeks it just um if I feel like I need more glow it's just another way to add more glow to you so those are all my um physical favorites but now for music my favorite favorite album right now is Kid Cudi's new one it's um Passion Pain and Demon Slain it's incredible. So basically like a while ago, Kid Cudi came out with like this rock album and everyone was like not really into it. Um, but he released this album and it sounds just like his old stuff that like everyone like loves like Pursuit of Happiness and Day and Night. It's just like great, great old Kid Cudi. So like every song on it is amazing. I really love By Design. That's like my go-to. Um, Rose Golden. It's featuring Willow Smith. So that's really cool. I, I think that's an amazing song too. And also Baptized in Fire is featuring Travis Scott. So good. For shows, my number one favorite TV show right now is This Is Us. It's on Hulu and it's just incredible. It's like one of those, it's like super dramatic and you get like super sucked into it and i just needed that in my life like i was i felt like i watched everything like um on netflix and hulu and i was like i just need a good show that i'm like so invested in these like characters lives and stuff so it's really really cool i really love that and you have to watch it if you haven't watched it it's like what are you doing so speaking of shows something very very exciting has come up Guidance season one, which is the show that I kind of starred in. Um, I don't, if you got, you might, you probably know about it, but it was just on the Go90 app. Um, so that was hard for people to see and it wasn't even in any other countries. It was only in the US and everyone was like, where can I see it? I'm so sad that I can't see it when they're like out of the country. So lucky for you guys in the UK, the UK is now streaming it. You can watch it there. So it's finally in the UK. It's on ITV2 and it's during the um, Too Awesome programming block. So make sure you guys see that. I'm like just kind of like announcing to you guys that if you are in the UK, you can finally watch it. It's very, very exciting and um, yeah, I'm very excited for more people to be able to see it. Also, by the way, um, Guidance is on Hulu too, so you can check that out if you have Hulu. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know what your favorites of the month are down below. Thanks for watching. Bye.